Oh. So here we are in the final stages of the Champions League. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome to our channel and welcome to Sunday. Hope everyone is doing okay today. Had another nice long lane this morning till 8 o'clock, didn't we? Yeah. Which was really, really nice. So, a little bit behind this morning, but again, we're not doing it, I think, today. It's one of those days where we're just going to go with the flow, aren't we? Um, seeing we're still a bit buzzing from last night, Liverpool won. Um, I recorded the um, his reaction, so he's a little bit now watching him getting carried away and stuff. So, he wants to watch the parade. What time is oh, it? Um, not too much of time the price starts. What time is the price? Is it four o'clock? Yeah. This is been silly. They only, um, they only went last night yeah, in Spain, know. so that's flying back. You know, it doesn't make sense how they've done that. So it wasn't it, last time they won it, it was a few days later, wasn't it? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, I, I don't guess know what why. We've got on our table, guys. Yeah, yeah. we've got a nice, yummy cooked cook breakfast. breakfast. So I'll show you that now. So here we are in the final stages of the Champions League. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> As you can tell, Liverpool won. <laughs> oh, bless her. We're not being nasty. I'm not. What, for the season they had in the Premier League, they deserve this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, bless them. Oh, oh, yeah, Stephen Steve Gerrard's in there. What's Stephen Gerrard doing there? What? So. Oh God! Not being nasty, even you've got to admit that was a bit of a stale game, wasn't it? It was. I did. Compared, compared to the Barcelona game. I'm not being nasty. I'm not a football fan, but. I'll be nasty. I will consider the Barcelona game fine. Yeah, that's the same. So that's just. Spurs didn't have. No. As I say, not being nice, so not being nice, so I'm not a football fan, nothing like that. But I noticed this game, I know you got ca carried away as such, but I've noted again, Lexi, they're putting their name on the title there. As I was saying, not being nice, as I was saying, not being nice, um, I know you'll get carried away, but you got more carried away in the Barcelona game than this one. Yeah. But you've got to be happy for them, my darling. They do, don't they? There you go. Doesn't that look nice? I cooked breakfast. I've not had these for ages. I've got bacon, hash browns, and sausages. Sam has got an egg. Because you like eggs, don't you? Mum doesn't like eggs. Yeah, you had a partial cooked breakfast down uh, way last week. A partial one we did, yeah. So, Ben! Ben! You want your breakfast? Mm -hmm. You want your breakfast? As you can see, Ben was supporting mm. Liverpool last night. Why didn't you wear your Liverpool pyjamas? Mm. So, you ready to want your breakfast? You're getting hungry. So, yes, it's always nice to go away, but it's nice to come back. Uh, the problem is, got all the holiday washing to sort out. There's a nice big pile of clothes there. That's the clothes we took with us and we didn't use. Um, because obviously, you can't guarantee the weather's going to be like. We didn't really need the um, jogging bottoms and jumpers and stuff. But it's, it's always best to take them anyway. Um, See, so yeah, I've got a nice on the floor there so I need to wash. Just wait for my washing machine to stop and I can put that load in. And then go into the, into the living room. You can see Stephen's going to Hoover. Gonna hoover. As you can see, the floor is absolutely disgusting. I think when the kids had the biscuits, all the crumbs everywhere, so...
it's a lazy Sunday today and uh, yeah I've just had a bath nice soak for a good hour <laughs> theory and uh, yeah I feel really relaxed this morning I'll tell you that six hour drive back up from Weymouth on Friday was horrendous I'll tell you you just desperate to see the motorway I'll tell you as soon as that M27 turned up you think yay you know it was a lot, lot much better as soon as it hit there and and then it was a much better ride home because even the A34 wasn't too bad either. And the A34 can be quite bad on some days. And uh, yeah, last night Liverpool went in the Champions League. So pleased for them. It wasn't that great of a game, if you know what I mean. Um, you know, after Salah scored that penalty on second minute, um, it just dragged off. It was like watching an old Division Two, like you know game you know it was like it was be honest we you know between that salad goal and when Origi finally put the game to bed it was like you know it was so depressing you're thinking to yourself you know give us some excitement please you know where's the next goal gonna come from and uh, I'm glad Origi scored that goal because it made it more more better for us to say that we are champions of Europe now so at the end of the day, Liverpool put the balls in the back of the net and Tottenham didn't, so that's Tottenham's own fault. You know, Alisson was the much better, you know, influence this year to last year with Carriers, because Carriers just really flopped like crazy last year on that game against Real Madrid. But, yeah, we put the balls in the net and we're champions of Europe, so later on this afternoon, the parade's on, so we're going to be watching that. And now, yeah, time to think about getting some lunch, so see you in a bit. So, see, Stephen has just done the potatoes for dinner. What are we having with them? Those pies from Aldi. Those pies from Aldi. Can't be asked. I've got that chicken now, haven't I? It's 12 o'clock. And I think we've cooked breakfast this morning as well, didn't we? So, mm. um, we're going to do some veggies with it. There's some carrots and some broccoli. Like yeah, because they're good to be one away. We, bought some, we took some tin carrots with and we didn't eat them, did we? No. So, have they? That'll do. So, what those four are they? They were ones, weren't they? They were good actually, weren't they? Because we bought the um, potato version. Well, we bought some big, the tin potatoes, and um, they were really good. They were. So I don't know if these were. Yeah, there. Yeah, they were really, really nice. So, so sometimes you find these sort of potatoes are salty, but these ones are the one. They were really, really nice. And it's amazing that that. How much were these when we bought them? Twenty. I can't that's point. No, seventy-five p. I think they were from Aldi. The tin carrots are fifteen p. Yeah, I think. Crazy, isn't it? You get potatoes in a tin for that price, and you have to buy. For I know. I know. Oh well. So yeah, so you can see Stephen sitting there in front of the telly. Um, you're getting ready for your teens victory parade, aren't you? You're looking forward to watching it. You're looking forward to seeing it. Quarter past eight. Is it half past three? Okay, so it's not going to take them that long to get from the airport to Anfield or Melbourne, wherever they're going, or they're going all around the streets and stuff. But anyway, you want to see Tara? What are you watching on? What are you watching on YouTube? Not watching anything silly, are you? I see you. You're eating chocolate buttons. Um, so see, Mr. Ben's not here. He's upstairs in his bedroom, isn't he? He's got a bit of an attitude on him today. Don't know what's the matter with him. Um, I think he's just in the seaside. I don't know what's wrong with him today. He's in that way to his own peace and company, then, isn't he? Because um, he has a couple of incidents and bang his ears. And as soon as he wants, well, he wants to stay to himself, he needs his bedroom anyway. Oh, you see? It's, oh, here he is. It's ben, you be careful that blind, please. So he's coming back down the stairs now, so. Well then guys, that brings Sunday's vlog to a close and not much of a vlog today I'm afraid guys, it's just recovering after the Weymouth holiday and that six hour trip back which was crazy and I tell you, I just don't know, it took three hours to go down on Monday and it took six hours to come back so just shows you what the traffic was like coming back out of Weymouth on the Friday morning, it was terrible Anyway guys, yeah, at the minute I'm watching the uh, parade, it's nearly two and a half hours in and uh, I don't know if they've reached their destination yet, but it's good because um, a lot of them are actually like signing a lot of stuff when the fans are throwing up. So it's really nice of them for doing that. Isn't it? it is actually. 
Actually, really, really yeah. nice. Um, obviously, we've all watched it as well. We can tell some of the players that uh, I've had a drink too many, you know, think of it. especially mm. Yogi Clark. He seems to be a bit, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> but you guys yeah. can see it. It's like I said earlier on, guys, yeah, it, it wasn't that great of a final, but at the end of the day, who put the balls in the back of the net and it was Liverpool? And that's it. But to me, the final will, will always be that Barcelona game. That Tottenham just didn't want to deliver a decent game last night. And uh, in theory, Liverpool they just wasn't up to par last night, but they managed to get the goals in. But anyway, they're Champions of Europe, guys. And for the sixth time, I remember the last one because Cheryl was pregnant with uh, Ben at the time. And uh, yeah, and uh, it's funny enough, we were living on the same road when it happened. Yeah, that so. Is, that, that is slightly spooky, actually, isn't it? Like yeah. I'm saying, um, um, living on the same road only a few doors up, so. Yeah, so 2005, how long ago was that? 14 mm. years ago? About 14 years ago. Yeah, so I would have been 25, mm. yeah. 25 yeah. When, when Rafa Benitez's team won the Champions League in Istanbul. And uh, yeah, guys, yeah, thanks very much for joining us today. And yeah, as a Liverpool fan, we're Champions of Europe. See you tomorrow. Bye.